Hi there, guys. Welcome to Hear You Play. Hello. Lindsay's here. Vance is here. Yep. We're playing Eternal Darkness, and we don't know where we're going. Nope. But that's part of the joy of this game, I think, is exploration. I guess. Part, oh, how beautiful. You say potato, I say potato. Last week. That's, oh, I already. They're spelled the same. <laughs> they're spelled the same. You say potato, I say potato. Potato, potato, <laughs> tomato, tomato. Whoa. Oh. What is it? Detail. A wooden plaque is fastened to the door, taking the place of the lock. A colored sigil is carved into the wood above a wide slot. The slot is just wide enough to insert a narrow blade. I bet I have one. Pro probably. On you? No. I bet Where would you have got it? Dinner. You got a, f <laughs> you got a knife from the dinner table. Problem solved. Father Ooh. knife. Power pit. What's this? What's this? Can you see that? Yeah, I see what it. What is it? I don't know. It's just a thing. Yeah. I guess yep, there's not yep. much going on in this room. Hey guys. Hey dudes. I wonder. Oh. Maybe some over there to look over at. Here, no, but you know, thing. Oh, nothing over there, huh? Okay, that's fine. It's just darkness. That's, can I can I get a butter knife from the table? Is I would say it's eternal darkness. This is very dark in here. There's not much going on in that room. Nothing. Nothing. There's just that one. All lock. right. Well, see you later, well, guys. Well, if we ever find it. See you later. I guess. I guess I'll just check out this part. Hey! Ugh. Purchase of the ancestral yeah, we blood of blood. Yeah, we, we found know that already. Yeah, it's scary stuff. Okay, well, let's open the door. What's in this one? Oh, I don't know. I don't like it all. It is kind of spooky. It's, uh... Hey, fridge. What? This is the same room. No, it's. Yeah, it is. No, no. Fire pit. Yeah. There's just two doors into the same room. All the rooms have fire pits in them because it's. Oh, I guess you're right. It's the same room. Do you hear whispering? I do. I don't know what to do about that. There's not much you can do. Oh. I guess you just gotta explore more times. I guess so. I'll go over here. Go to the far room. This one? Yeah, why not? Is there a door? Oh, oh you can it. go in that one. Oh. Oh. oh, oh There's oh, the examines oh. over there. Where? I think it's a piano. Okay. Grand piano yeah. stand, sorry. A grand piano stands here, awaiting the hands of a decent musician. Unfortunately, Edward never really lived up to that description, and as such, the piano fell into disuse. That's rude. That might come in handy to know later. Caw, caw, caw. Oh, I can't go that is way. Is that a birdo? Uh, um, Some sort of birdie? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh. Ooh. That's nice. That's that's good. Who took that? Who's, who's the wise guy that took that? Oh. That's kind of creepy. Can't even see it. What is? The illustration features a collection of strange line designs related to each other in a cyclical manner. There appears to be some significance to it, but it isn't particularly evident. So it seems like whenever she looks up, there's something to look at. Because if I do that, you can't... She just kind of looks at oh, it. Oh, I see. Then it has to have the closer. examine button. Okay. What's, oh, What's that thing? It looks like a picture, but maybe it's like ripped or off or something? Yeah, it looks like part of it's missing. Okay, and... Okay. Can I go? Oh, a table set for one. Alex's grandfather's Edward. Oh God, can you? Alex's read it? grandfather, Edward's private nature meant that he never had many visitors, and this is the lonely evidence of it. Okay. Oh man. Yeah. It's a whole big room. Okay. Same well, one. I wonder if I could take that knife, but I guess I can't. No, I guess it's somewhere else. Um, okay. Well, you might as well get right. the heck out of this well, room. Well, I just want to make sure there's nothing else to look at over here. Okay. I don't think there is. Hmm. But no, I'm good. No, you're good. Time to go upstairs. Hey, Alex, let's go. Well, I think we've seen all we can see on this floor. I think you're right. Time to go up stairs. See if you can find a sword or something. Probably find a spooky is what I'll find. Maybe. What else was there? There was the puzzles with the telescope and whatnot. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> that guy again. Yeah, we know. We know. Dead I'll go this guy. way. I'll go this way. Okay. Probably a door over there. Mm-hmm. No. No, oh, it's a secret. What? What is it? No, it's nothing. Just. Just a room. Some mansions just have like. There's so know, much space. They have like. They, they just have extra. Ending hallways. It's just area. It's just like you can go yeah, stand over space. this part for That's no reason. Ridiculous. Put a chair and a lamp there. Be like, here, whatever. Reading nook. Uh, ah. Yep. Yeah. Same one. Same creepy lady. Oh. Well, what the. Crying out loud. What the crying out loud? What the crying out loud? 
How about I just like quit the game and go play Harvest Moon or something? Oh! That'll. <gasps> I bet. Oh. See what oh, the detail is. Five fifteen. Look at the push B again. I want to see. Beautiful carriage clock. The hands appear to be stuck yet. The clock continues to tick. The time permanently set to three thirty-three, <laughs> like in the dream. I thought it said five fifteen. Yeah, you're backwards. Uh, <laughs> there's a key in the back of the clock, presumably for winding it. Should I look at the key? Uh, All yeah. right. Alex picks up the desk clock and pulls the key from it. However, there's something odd about the key. It isn't for winding it at all. It looks like a dresser key. Well, but ding, we did a thing. What in the Yay. crying out loud? Yes. What so three thirty-three. Three thirty-three. Look at the clock again. I'm curious. Ooh, whoa. Uh, yeah, we know. He's you, creepy. You though. want me to look at the clock again? Yeah, I want to see it. Three thirty-three. Three thirty-three. Okay. Okay. That's all. It's well, just... that that. Um, that answers the clock question. Yeah, so it was this um, way, wasn't it? Yeah, it was over there. Okay. I think it was to this in that dough. Yeah. <laughs> I believe. Yeah. Yeah, and, and then there was another then dough. It was closer to the end. I believe it was over here. Well, we're gonna solve a puzzle. That's fun. We're gonna do it. Was it down there? <laughs> yeah, it was. Go mess with that clock. I'm gonna. Gonna. Oh. Yay. Yes. Oh. It's well, good. that's just now a it's good. dead giveaway. Tell us all about it. You've gone too far. How do you tell the time? That's how. Did I do it? I don't know. Maybe one more minute? Uh. It is 3.33. Oh, it's like 3.32, I guess. Okay, so, Ferdy? Did it. Oh, yeah. Oh, the bookshelf. I knew it all along. Oh, I'm mean, smart. Oh, yeah. Okay, so, there Guess wasn't... a big smart me. There wasn't a dresser so far. No. No? No, that was locked anyways. Okay. And... Oh, this is... Uh-oh. Oh, boy. This is gonna get scary. This is where Spookies live. We're gonna have to play soon. I know. Open the door. Uh-oh. <laughs> uh... Oh. Secret study. Oh, magic glowing yeah, book. Don't touch. You know what? If I saw a glowing book, I'd be like, uh-uh. Especially the biggest no, book in the world. thank you. It looks like it's banned by human flesh. I should probably read it. Edward Roivas' study is filled with arcane knickknacks, mementos of yesteryear, and other cultures. The odor of ancient texts is faintly noticeable under the peppering of dust that covers every surface except one. The desk had been the center activi of activity, and not a mote of dust is on it. Here, Alex's grandfather had worked, perhaps even hours before the end. Oh my god. Okay. Dear Creep. diary. A large leather bound antique book rests upon uh, the third desk. Uh, no. Okay, no. I probably should read Punch it. Punch the book. That, <laughs> look at her. She's, all, <laughs> she's ready to fight it. Oh, she's reading it. What if you just said no and the game ended it? It's like, and then she went home. <laughs> yeah, she was like, done with it. Oh, what? Ghost butthole. Get, get. Oh, big butthole. Ow. Not, I mean, it's not actually a butthole. I'm just joking. I had no knowledge of what was to come. Nor did I care. Nor did I care. You should care. You gotta care about something. As you read this, uh oh. You will come to learn fear as I would stop right there. Yep. Like no, nope. Will come to understand. Oh, this just seems too spooky. No, thank you. Well, thanks a lot, Grandpappy. Once I could not see beyond the veil of our reality. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. To see those who dwell behind. Okay. The dead guys? What is your purpose? Well, I have learned the frailty, frailty of flesh. Oh, ancient Persia. Oh. I was once a fool. We all were. That's okay. Do I have to play this Persian guard guy now? Heck yeah. No way. No, I'm not doing it. Oh. Are they They're speaking Persian? And are in high spirits. Today's battle is but one of many. If we are to complete our mission at once, Centurion Augustus. He's talking in English? It changed. Oh, maybe because it's like, just for a fact, it's like, we're just gonna just pretend they're still speaking Persian. Maybe. Or his orders. Yeah, that. That's right. 
I thought it wasn't speaking English at first. I think they, I don't think they were at first. Huh. But I don't know, because you were talking, so I don't know. I'm sorry, I ruined everything with my voice. Jeez. No, I'm okay with that. Come to us. Okay, that sounds good. Sure thing. I'm on my way. BRE. I mean, BRE. BRT. BRT. BLT. Come to us. Pios Augustus. Pios. I wish I was a Pios. I was trying to say su superfluous today. I, I said it right for the first time. I had to look it up on YouTube and listen to it a few times. Those are fun videos. To watch. Super, but it was the real one. It wasn't. It wasn't a fake. I know. One, but the fake ones. Those are fun, fun too. Hey, that was superfluous. That that pillar had the picture. That one on the right side. That's the picture from the sword singer. Oh. The one in the mansion. Oh no! Ouch! Ow, my body! Oh, I'm dead. I'm no. a ghost now, probably. Whoop. Oh. I have been teleported into a castle. Uh-oh. It's me. I'm it's a me, Pius Bedustu. D oh. The dais on the floor is finely crafted, inlaid with gold and gems that Pius can't identify. A strong linear design is situated in the middle and is equally unknown to the Roman soldier. Like a Roman soldier. That's the same design from the, from the mansion. How do I get out you of that? You go forward. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Ooh, sword attack. Maybe he'll go Alex the sword later. How? They're thousands of years apart. I bet they'll come together. Neat. I bet. Speaking of coming together. What? Uh, next time we play this game on Here You Play, we'll find out more about the decorations on the wall. Okay. And how they're a mixture of ancient cultures. Civilizations that have long since turned to dust. Perhaps the dungeon is all that remains of them. Perhaps. Bye. Bye-bye. Oh,